Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If it wasn't my last video, then you'd know that my tutorial was on how I was able to transform my original 3D avatar into a more human light expressive avatar. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to generate a cartoon avatar for your Faces YouTube channel. This avatar is also a lot more expressive, they can talk, they can walk, and they can make a lot more gestures. I'm going to be using a different set of tools, and a good part about it is that all these tools you have like a really general free version. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I encourage you to subscribe it's my youtube channel so that you never miss an update so the first step is to generate an image i already do have a prompt that i prepared and you can go into chat gpt and come up with an idea and chat gpt will be able to generate a full real prompt for you but i already have a prompt in here so i'm going to paste the prompt in the description box the tool i'm using is called nextgen.ai and we're going to leave the link to this tool in the description box for easy navigation and this tool has a really generous street version so i encourage you to try it out in terms select the orientation so i'm just going to select landscape and then i'm going to click on generate so now that the image has been generated the next step for us is to go on to the image to video generator tool and i'm using this tool called helio ai and like i mentioned this tool has a generous free version i haven't seen any image to video generator tool that has such a german version so i'm actually impressed it gives you about a thousand credits for most of the image to video generator tools like you don't even get like more than 200 credits so this is really good and for every five seconds we do i believe it is about carried to 70 credits so this this really works really well um what i like about this tool is the ability to decide on like the type of camera angles or camera moments you want so you can really decide what type of shot you want to have in your video i use and generate the video from text or you could generate the video from using an image if you also want to generate some more consistent characters in your video and you should be able to also do so by using the subject reference for the purpose of this tutorial i'm just gonna be using the image to video tab and i just grabbed the image for my computer but now that i have the image generated on my computer the next step is to put in a prompt and so i'm just gonna say um the lady is a content creator she's sitting into the camera and moving her hands and gets up to walk to the front of the room and then in terms of the model you can really decide the type of model you want to go for i'm going to use the second one because i advertise more so like 2d and then i'm gonna click on on the i2v 01 live for the model and i'm just gonna click on genmate so okay so our video has been generated now and as you can see, she was first sitting down and she got up to talk. So I'm just gonna download this. So for the purposes of this tutorial, I'm just gonna be covering only two scenes. My next scene would be hey having coffee. So what I'm gonna do is um, I would want my next scene to start from where the last scene ended. So I'm just gonna go to the video frame extractor too. Then I'm gonna drag the video in there, and then I'm gonna drag it to the end of the video so that it shows her full body standing. And I'm just gonna extract it so that my next video starts from her standing i'm just gonna come back into helio ai and what i'm gonna do is for my image to redo this time around i'm gonna drag the image of the last scene in there so now that we have it in here i'm gonna change the prompt i'm gonna put in a prompt about the lady walks to drink coffee and i'm just gonna click on um generate here as you can see i still have my credits still going on okay so the video for the second scene has been generated i'm just gonna click on this and download it now the next step is for us to go into cup cart so i'm just gonna go into cup cart and i'm gonna join the two scenes together if you don't have cup cart you could use as i have video editing applications so i'm just gonna drag the video in here and i'm gonna drag the sitting scene as well i'm just gonna play this now so that you see what a full video looks like select both of these scripts and click on create compound clip and then the next step is i'm just gonna export this because we also want to include the audio if you don't know how to like clone your voice then i would recommend you check my tutorial on 11 lats um i'll i'll leave it somewhere in this uh in this video so that you can go check that out as well up until this point every tool i've used has a general free version so you really don't have to like pay for anything so um the next tool is uh sync labs right so this is where we are going to up include the lip sync and they also does have like a generous free version so i'll encourage you to try it out um but you sign up to sync but so 
you get some credits to play around with. So I'm just going to now upload my video in here. And like I said, you need an audio file as well. But the next step for me is to just include my audio. And I already do have an audio here. I'm just going to click on generate. Okay, so my video has been generated now. The list sync has been applied. I'm going to play the final version. Have you ever imagined getting no pay raise for doing the work of three people? Well, that is the story of this young millennial. Let's call her Joyce. We have a video generated, um, and at this point, you could just, uh, if you want a longer video, you can just repeat the same process over and over again. I was able to use all these tools for free. So I entire you to try it out. Let me know in the comment section what you think about it. If you want to see more videos like this, then don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also like my videos. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.